What's up guys? Back from another video. You might notice something looks a little different now with these cuttings. Yes, it is these two metal cuttings. I'm going to describe this first before we go over anything else. These needed to be replaced as the other ones were yellowing. I think the problem was there was too much sun or scorch coming out of that window. They're fine for a little while, which is why I keep changing them. These ones over here are even yellowing. This leaf's ready to pluck off. See, it's yellow. So they're not doing well in this window, but they're doing all right. These ones are still pretty dark green, other than that leaf. These ones are new, new cuttings. And these ones are still good. So the screened ones help, but these ones yellow fastest. But they still do grow for the first month or two. So we'll do another update May 9th. Um, but I want to show you guys the ones that were previously there, which are put in this window back here. These ones um, actually have turned a little bit more green after being moved back here. But here they are, They're all of these, and they have turned a little more green. All of those where it was in the middle windows that you've seen the last ones in there. This here, I must have watered too much, and it's still full of water. But this is in dirt. And there's just that random thing. This is in dirt. And these here are the ones that have been back here the whole time, growing vigorously green. So this is the window they like the most. For sure. And back here, this one was in the dog room window. And these ones have been back here. So there's a clear show of what one... Um, what they like most but anyway there's them and i'm going to show you guys these real quick it's an april 9th update on the cuttings these ones are still going good these ones are new so here's the new growths on them as you can see you smell mm. extremely good like spring air this one here we've had in there a little longer that was in the last guys in a last update video when I said I wanted to fill it in, I placed this one there that day, and that's how much it grew. Um, but then I tore all the other ones around it out, left it, and now it's a part of these new ones. So that's kind of what happened with that one, why it's a little bit bigger. Um, here, we've got some lilac ones that didn't survive, actually. It's got a large limnical thing there, and some large leaves. Um... A spirea plant which is just now starting to die but did did actually look really nice and a little spruce that the dogs ripped out of the planter by running so i decided to bring it in see what it would do and it is actually blooming kind of crazy see the blooms over on that side too that is actually kind of crazy dang anyway though there is the plants in here Cutting update. These ones are actually kind of dying too, but they have rooted. So if we look in here, there is actually a lot of root structures at the bottom. I can lift these out and show you. Look at that. Because they've been in here so long, they've had that chance. A little pink mold coming through the leaf. It's kind of weird. Or it could be the red from the cup, maybe. But they are still going. These are the red tag dogwoods. We got them in the yard. They um, have not bloomed yet outside, but they are inside. So yeah, this is the plant cutting update. Let's take one more look back here. At these. These. Holy. There's a lot of plants there. A lot of cups, too. And these. This one doesn't look big, but the roots of this barely fit in this whole cup. It is so weird. It is very strengthenedly set in there now. It's been rotting in. So, yeah, kind of crazy. But anyway, that is the plant cutting update of April 9th. We will have another one ready to go for May 9th, and we'll see just what the plants look like then. Anyway, we'll see you guys in the next one. And we'll also see what happened with this spruce. I don't know if it'll die or not, but I'll remove whatever dies. Oh, and, and this. I took the tape off prematurely. I shouldn't have took it off. Um, but 
this is a grafted cutting and it's actually still growing since a long time ago. But until up until I took the tape off, there was a film growing them together. So these are kind of sealed now. They've actually fused together as one stick. That is just insane. They've done it enough though. If I would have left the tape on it when it went further, which is what I'm gonna do soon. I'm gonna do another one of them. But they are still growing, so that is so cool. Um, because this one ain't even sitting in water. It's above water. So it's this stalk sending it water into that one and growing them tips. Because I, I know it's just not happening because they won't grow if they're not sitting in water. So that's kind of cool. But anyway, we'll see you guys in the next kind of cutting update.